Good evening, Key and Core Enjoyers. I'm gonna hang up my lights. I realize my last two videos have been lit like I'm kind of filming from the ninth circle of the underworld, and I don't really think that's the vibe we're going for here. So I'm finally gonna do the thing I've been putting off doing and hang up lights around my room. I think we as a society have evolved past the need for like the TikTok LEDs. I think we need, we need to start making some changes. I think the new It Girl um room lighting needs to be christmas lights very very pinterest that's 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 my inspiration really also chloe price been having a big life is strange phase resurgence lately that's surely a good sign my room as you can kind of see it has that sort of ceiling slant let me move the camera this is not helpful i might have an ass ton of command strips and i'm going to put the lights right there do you guys like my monkey collection and pitbull he stayed too anyways i also want to use this video as an opportunity to sort of make a get to know me video i made one of those in like 2020 but um it's about to be 2024 so things have changed a little bit i went from being stuck in my room because of a pandemic to being stuck in my room because of myalgic encephalomyelitis so ah! so cool so cool freaking epic merry yaoi miss by the way it's probably gonna be past Christmas when I upload this, but whatever. Let's start off strong. I am 18, almost 19. I was watching back some of my old videos and I said you don't get a foot reveal until I'm 18. You don't get a foot reveal until I hit a million subscribers, actually. What can I talk about if I'm 18? I can talk about like, I don't know, sex and drugs, but I don't, I don't feel like I should do that. I feel like that's just not something I should do. You can't really do drugs and stuff at 18, but you can have sex. You can adopt a child at 18. You can have sex at 18. Can't buy alcohol though. America moment. I don't know what I'm doing. Believe it or not, being a high schooler and then getting sick and not being able to leave your house. Yeah, that kind of kind of thins out your friends. So I'm kind of a, I'm kind of a loner nowadays, which has been good for me, honestly, because I think I needed to learn how to be alone. Obviously, you need to have some kind of friends, but it's good because so much of my happiness relied on other people and that's not good. TBH, that's not good. Most of my YouTube experience was blonde, so I'm, I'm brunette now. I literally just let it grow all the way out. I'm a carpenter. I walked my dog and showered today, and that's more energy than I usually exert, and now I'm filming a YouTube video and hanging things up. So I'm not, I'm not sure why I'm doing this, actually. This is a really bad idea. I live with my mom, dad, dog, grandpa. Yeah, grandpa, he's, um... <laughs> All I'm gonna say is he is he's an 80 year old white guy let's see I could just stop there really he's an 80 year old white guy he loves some Fox News some Newsmax that's all you really need to know about him he's very loud and he coughs a lot he's been smoking since he was like 16 unfiltered though so he's going great I swear to god the filters are what's gonna kill you with the cigarettes and no sister used to live with my sister but then she moved out she moved in with her fiance who I have a lot of feelings about him. Yeah, he's... He's a dickhead. <laughs> I hope nobody from my family watches my videos. But if you do, if my sister watches my videos, just kidding! Yeah, I'm, I'm just gonna stop talking. In my original video, I'll link it in the description. No, I won't actually, because that is not an accurate reflection of who I am at all. In that video, I mentioned being a baby metal fan as a core part of my identity. And yeah, yeah, that's still true. I am so Pinterest right now. Okay, I feel like I'm allowed to admit it because I made, okay, I made a TikTok account and I started posting content and someone was like, oh my God, Key and Core? And I was like, and that, that account was, um, it's a furry account. I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep it a hundred. I have no shame about the fact that I'm a furry. It's just the funny part about doing this is that I can't just like do something silly and post my face in an unrelated fandom because then everyone's just like, you. Dude, I thought I was safe in my baby metal account. One of my favorite mutuals, I was talking about like YouTube because I posted a really sweet comment about how somebody was like, oh, I hope he feels better soon. And then my mutual was like, oh my god, I watched your like candy tour video back in 2020. And I was like, <laughs> like, no, no, stop. I thought I was safe. So that was actually kind of um, the worst thing to ever happen to me. I'm actually gonna talk about the fact that I'm not really on good terms with a lot of the people in my vlogs. I, I don't really have any beef with them, but they have some beef with me. You know, being stuck inside your house kind of makes you realize that having beef with anybody from high school, it's pretty stupid actually. Like you expect me at my big age of 18 years old to be holding a grudge from high school. And I guess that was like only a year ago or whatever, but dude, have we, have we not grown up? I was about to say comment your age because I want to know my average age demographic, but definitely don't 
comment that. I'm just assuming you guys are like around my age, maybe a little bit younger. This is looking freaking lit. And not only in a lighting sense. Oh my God, this is freaking epic. I'm gonna get an animal net for Christmas so I can hang up all my stuffed animals. I'm very excited. There's a lot to be excited about in my life, despite everything, you know? Like, my life is definitely a nightmare hellscape in which I cannot seem to wake up from, but there are little things, you know? In March, there's gonna be a new baby metal show. Also, fun fact, baby metal came very close to um, where I live, which is shocking because usually artists just go to DC, but obviously I couldn't go because I was sick. But then it got canceled due to weather reasons. So I don't know if that's just God doubling down on not wanting me to see baby metal or if that's God kind of apologizing. If I can't have them, nobody can. Either way, I'll take it. I love puzzles, which kind of sounds boring, but I swear to God, you have not felt true joy until you're just sitting there all zenned out doing a puzzle. Ugh, nothing like it, man. TikTok sucks. And I'm not only saying that because I'm a YouTuber, I'm saying that because it does. And I want to delete it, but I literally don't because of my edit folder. Every night I like to go to my edit folder and look through my saved. I just like to look through edits because I love editing. Not only looking at them, doing them. Fun fact, I'm an editor. I don't post them on here, obviously, because I... It's not really the place, I guess. I edit all the things I love. I'll put something in now. Um, but yeah, I, I love that. Do you guys like my editing? Let me know in the comments. I love editing. It's so much fun. Except when it's um, kind of psychological torture, which is also most of the time. I use Video Star um, because I cannot be bothered to learn After Effects. I've been told it isn't that difficult, but I just don't feel like cracking it also. It feels like a whole thing and I'm just not in the mood to do that. Twitter is my favorite social media. My oomphs are like family. We don't play about Twitter in this household. I'm kind of boring nowadays, <laughs> which is a good thing, I think. I think it's good for you to, you know, mellow out after a while. Mellowing out at 18 is actually pretty lame, I think, but whatever. I don't really have any other options. It is kind of um, screwed up that I didn't really have a normal year of high school aside from junior year. I got one year of high school. That kind of that kind of sucks. But hey, you can see in my videos, I was, I was lit, all right? I was having fun. If you guys have any video ideas, please let me know in the comments, but keep in mind, I'm stuck in my room with very limited things to do. Um, actually, I filmed this like before Christmas and as you can tell by the upload date it has been a handful of weeks and by a handful I mean like two. Time flies when you're having fun because I have been going out. Here are three gay little monkeys to prove it. Here's here's a here's a Frankie doll I got at Target to prove it. Also shut up about how stupid my bandana looks right now. I don't I'll insert a picture. I looked great earlier today, okay? Shut up. And you know what I was doing earlier today? I was walking around Dollar Tree with my friend Cal and then we went back to his house and we hung out for a little bit. Um it exhausted me thoroughly and I am very sore. But point of the matter is I am a little bit more open to doing things outside of my house. Just a little bit though, just a spoonful of outdoor exposure. It was like 40 degrees today. So it, it maybe not like outside, but you know what I mean? Things are looking up for Mr. Kean. It's the year of the core, baby. If you have any um, ideas for me to film on a computer, like if you guys want any tier lists, any gaming videos, if you guys just have any suggestions, please let me know because I have a lot of silly little video ideas, but I want like, I want something that you guys want me to do. Thank you for listening to me ramble about myself. See you next time, sillies.